Hello, this is Cindy. Welcome to my channel and today 24 of the Jelly Postcard Play Challenge. I've got a couple of elements here. Um, this is a Stampin' Up! punch and I just used a piece of scrap paper um, that has some pretty flowers on it to make a halo around my Elizabethan lady because houses are my theme and a castle is a house, right? I think that's a castle. It looks like a castle. I'm making it a castle. So there, I've decided it's a castle. I'm using Vintage Photo because this is kind of vintagey today. So we're going to go around the edge of our photograph. This came out of an encyclopedia type book that was very old. And you could tell it's kind of old because the picture is kind of faded. So that's all right. We're going to close that up and get out the glue stick. You, you will also may be able to tell from the things on my table that I did day 25 before I did day 24, and that was completely by accident. I don't know where my head was. I was thinking it was the 25th, so I did the 25th, and you'll see that tomorrow. But I did them in reverse. So on this particular piece, I have... Um, on, on my card, I just have a piece of music. I don't have any jelly printing on here. We've got to get a little jelly printing on here. So I'm going to figure out how far up I need my halo. I think that's going to go just fine there. I have my number all set, and I have an idea what I want to do with the number. Oh, I forgot where I need to put her. Yeah, a little bit higher. Right about there. I like this particular stamp. I just got it from Stampin' Up. Um, let me get a little bit of a scrap here. Hang on. I just had a scrap of white. What did I do with it? Okay, my scrap of white has disappeared. Oh, well, guess I don't want to use it anyway then, right? If you can't find it, if you've lost it, no, I have definitely lost it. All right, pausing. Okay, I am back and I found a piece. This is um, off of a gel print that actually will be on tomorrow's card. I told you I did day 25 before I did day 24, and this was... In my box we'll just set that now you know what I'm not keeping everything I cannot keep everything and I'm just let me figure I put her down here we're just gonna give her a gravel pathway to stand on here problem is I got a little bit of white there and I think I want to not have that white and if I put it here There, stick that up in the back of the box. We're going to go ahead and use the glue stick on this. So now I do have a piece of jelly printing on my paper here. Yeah. So go right over here. No, nope, now we're not a little bit off. Now there we go. We're still a little bit long, but that's okay. We'll cut that off in a bit. So there's my jelly printing. She is a sticker, but I will be doing some work on her anyway, some glue on her anyway, just to make sure she sticks. This is a Tim Holtz lady. I have not bought, the, I don't do a lot with figures. You're going to see me doing a lot these next couple days, but I don't do a lot with figures. I'm not a big fan of them, um, but these were a gift, and I have enjoyed having just this many because it's it gives me a chance to play around with them some when I do want them. I just don't want them very often, that's all. Oh, I want to put some glue on there. 
just a little bit just to make sure. Because in this heat, you never know. Okay, there she goes. I probably should have done the same thing around there, but that's all right. Let me cut that little piece off. There we go. Okay, now I want to put up at the top, I have this washi, and I'm going to use just one little piece of it. Throw a little bit of glue on the back of it. And put it right up to the top. And I want to trim my two down a little bit more. Come on. And put that on while it's still sticking to me. And I want to trim my four down some more. I think it's okay that way. I just need to trim it there. And there. There, 24. All right, one more thing to do, and then this one will be finished. And that is to come around. You know what? I think I want to do... I don't have a fancy trimmer on the corners. It would be really cool if I did. But I'm going to come around and corner around. Now that I've got all my pieces in, I'm okay. There's a little concern there. It's going to cut off some of that 24, but I'm good. All right, now we'll go ahead and do this. And this will finish off day 24. There we go. Day 24 of the Jelly Postcard Play Challenge. If you're enjoying these videos, please make sure you hit the subscribe button and hit like to let YouTube know that you like them. In the meantime, this is Cindy signing off.